Hey guys, what's up? It's me, your Sarah. I'm giving you a little date on my fish that I got. I don't remember what day, but it, I, it was before Christmas one, day, one of those days that my Christmas tree in the back. Yes, it is two or three, maybe like four days after Christmas, but that's okay. And I'm going to show you guys. We have four left, of course. Um, one of them, wait, we got, we had six, two of them died. They're so small that they get sucked up against the filter, which here they are. So that filter back there sucks them up because they're so tiny. Here they are. That's a red, red-tailed shark over there. And then three goldfish, we got four left. Um, oh my gosh, so there's like a random white rock right there. You guys can't see, that's so funny. Because we don't put any white rocks in there. Eh, maybe the color came off of it. But, other than that, they are doing pretty good. This tank does need a little bit of a cleaning, as you can tell. He's so cute. That's Rudolph, because we named him Rudolph because Christmas was coming up, and then that one. They think I'm going to feed them, because every time we come up to the tank, we feed them. But I already fed them earlier, so I don't really want them eating too much. But I will feed them a little bit, which got some dried up dead worms. So just put it through that hole right there. Then it goes in there, and they will eat it. Let me get you guys a... That's the tank. Um, if you're wondering where we got this stuff from, Rocks Amazon. We got them on Amazon. We got the Plant Pets Smart, I think. Pet Smart. I don't know. Maybe Amazon, actually. I'm not too sure. Um, no, we we got that at the pet store. All right, Smart. And then we got that thing back there. Excuse me, fish. <laughs> Rude. Okay, anyways, we got that at PetSmart when we got our fish. So, and don't worry, I'm not making these marks with my fingers. It's part of the fish tank, which that's because we need to clean it. That's okay. If you were to be in the water right now, look, he's upside down. He was. It would look like this for a close-up. That's what that looks like, the bubbles. I'm not putting you guys in the water. You're just outside the tank. Um, it would be so cool to swim in here, don't you guys think? But that's the tank. That's all the messy stuff. It's really not that messy underneath. But they're doing good so far. So that was just an update on how how would how they were doing. Good, other than the two that died we of course they had to be the goldfish because the goldfish are pretty tiny so it sucked them up the red tailed shark hasn't died yet because he's usually they stay on the bottom not they come up to get food and then they'll go back to the bottom but the current sucks them towards the filter and then the filter sucks them up and then they die in the filter which isn't good. Oh, I want to show you guys them eating. That kid's chewing food. They're eating right now. But yeah, if you don't have any pets and you've never had one before, a fish would be a good start off because fish are pretty easy. Other than cleaning, jeez, uh, um, thing just fell on me. Other than cleaning their tank and feeding them every, usually you feed them every day if they're like any other, um, usually we, you feed them every day if they're anything other than betas. But when you have a beta fish, you feed them every other day because beta fish don't eat as much because they don't grow as big as goldfish. 
and other kinds of fish can grow that big. Which they do grow big, but not big enough. So, yeah. You don't feed them too much. So, every other day you feed a beta. Uh, then, yeah. Look at him upside down. He's upside down. I think that's how he swims. That is so cool. But anyways, guys. I hope you guys had a great day, night, morning, afternoon, whatever it is in your side of the world. I hope you had a great whatever. Peace out.